Evening, everyone. Joe for jazbeeshobbyland.com. We are doing 2017 Panini Donruss Optic Baseball, a full 12-box case. Pick your team number one from jazbeeshobbyland.com. This is a full course meal, folks. I know we have our 10 Buck Breaks channel. Our 10 Buck Breaks, they're like appetizers, right? This 12-box break, it's a full course meal. So thanks for nomming on this break with us, ladies and gentlemen. Big thanks to everybody who dug deep and filled up this break. There's everyone right there. And here it is, 2017 Panini Optic, Donner's Optic Baseball. Good luck, everybody. Now, from my understanding, they added hot boxes. I'm pretty sure last year they only had two hot boxes. I'm pretty sure it was just um, an autograph hot box and then a, a, par a parallel hot box. Right, but I think this year they doubled that, from my understanding. But I don't know. We'll we'll find out in a second. We'll find out in a second. All right, there we go. Let's we'll start with the first box right here. So here's what the box looks like. We're going four cards per pack, twenty packs per box. We got throwback designs, which I thought was cool. Mickey Mantle on the front. I like that. Two autographs per box, on average. Hot boxes featuring five autographs or twenty numbered parallels. So there's a lot of things happening here, folks. And and even in speaking of Aaron Judge, right? That's what people are looking for, of course. Including some other hits. But even Aaron Judge like uh rookie rated rookie cards, like non parallel cards, could still go for a lot in this set. Okay, good luck, everybody. Donner's Optic Baseball, always uh, always a nice break to do. Last year's set, I thought was really great. And the Donner's Optic Baseball, Donner's Optic Football, Donner's Optic Basketball, I feel like was a real hit with everybody. Um, a lot of great quality of the cards were great. Design is great. The on-card autos are great. The parallels are great. You know, like, and I, the resale value, I think, was was pretty solid as well. Great price point on this. So I think a lot of people are happy with this. So we're looking forward to doing this, to doing this break. A lot of big news in baseball. A lot of trades happening. So we'll see how, how all that shakes out by the end of the month. Just a couple weeks. We'll be at the National in Chicago while a lot of the big trades are going down, while the trading deadline approaches. So it should be pretty exciting. I'm wonder, wondering what my Dodgers are going to do. Right, slide the camera over just a little bit. Okay, good luck, everybody. Nick Markakis leads us off. And Cody Bellinger rated rookies. Nice. Todd Frazier, seven, uh, 71 out of 140. He went to the Yankees, right? I think. There's Giancarlo Stanton, 14 out of 149 for the Marlins. Uh, that Todd Frazier will still go to the White Sox. That'll be for Adam. And Giancarlo Stanton, of course, will go to the Marlins. That'll be Matt. And there's Jake Thompson, 51 out of 99 for the field. That's right, X-Line. My Dodgers are straight fire right now. Alex Dickerson, this might be a hot box, 116 out of 149. A lot of parallels so far. And our first autograph is Raimel Tapia. That'll go to the Rockies. And that'll be for the X-Line. There you go, X-Line. Helping us out. With the big break here, scoring the hits. Oh, I thought that was going to be gold. It's not. Yeah, my Dod Dodgers are playing very well. Very happy about it. 22 out of 149. Jose Altuve for the Astros. That'll go to the X line. Pete Rose, blue, 73 out of 149. This must be a hot box with all these parallels here. Evan Longoria, 29 out of 149. Blue for the Rays. That'll go to Alex Lindsay. Ryan Healy for the A's, 27 out of uh, 99. 
That'll go to the A's. For the Angels, 299 out of 299, Albert Pujols. Joey Votto, Diamond Kings, those are not numbered. There's two low right here. Love the designs on the Optic Baseball. There's Tyler Naquin out of 199 for the Indians. Adrian Beltre, is that a green? No, it's not. That's just the way it looks. Tony Gwynn for the Padres out of 299. Michael Fulmer to 199. Tigers. Frank Thomas, blue for the White Sox. That'll go to Adam Wilson, 64 out of 149. I think these are not numbered. Yeah, there's Orlando Arcia, though, for the Brewers, 11 out of 149. These are pretty cool, too. There's Ian Hab. Gregory Polanco, blue to 149 for the Pirates. Uh, that Yadier Molina is a parallel. 5 out of 99 for the Cardinals. Pete Rose again. 154 out of 299 for the Reds. There's Josh Donaldson, blue. That's 7 out of 50. We're creeping closer and closer to a train whistle. Carlos Gonzalez out of 99 for the Rockies. And rated rookie Alex Reyes, blue, for the Cardinals. That's out of 149. There's another car, Jonathan Villar, down there. And the last auto is Ryan Healy, rated rookie autograph. That goes to the A's, Jay Kreider with that one. And that is 31 out of 125. There you go. So I'm going to sleeve the autos. A lot of parallels here. I'm going I'm to take care of these. I'll sleeve and top load these at the end of the break, just in the interest of time. All right, next box, good luck everybody. Yeah, the Cardinals went fast. Was there some particular name in the Cardinals that everyone's going for? Ziggy, what's going on? Hello, hello. Yeah, Craig was looking for the Cardinals too. All right, box two in this 12 box break. Not yet, Ziggy, we just got started. So th we just finished box one, it was a hot box, parallel hot box. So we found a ton of parallels in there. And now we are starting box two. Now we have pick your team number two in Optic Donner's Optic Baseball. Uh, it's pretty much already halfway there. So if you wanna go for that, let's do it. We have not touched any of the other new releases today on this channel on Jaspie's Hobbyland. So check out Pantheon Football. Check out Grand Reserve Basketball. Check out Marvel Premiere. All new releases today. And we've got some Ginter on the 10 buck break site. All right, box number two in pick your team number one. Good luck, everybody. Tulo will lead us off. And Optic Autographs, James McCann. Nice one for the Tigers. Paul Harris on the board with the Tigers. In fact, I'll just leave that up right now. Mark chapter 10, verse 27. I think that's a new one. May not be a common one. These these ones are not numbered. They look cool though. Jose De Leon as a ray, refractor. And five out of five, Alex Bregman. Five out of five, 1983 retro signatures, Alex Bregman, a train whistle in the second box. Guess what? That goes to the X line. The X line says, you know what? I'll do a grown-up break. I'll do a big boy break. I'll get the Astros. That's not too bad at all. <laughs> right on the card as well. Absolutely train worthy. Out of fives and under. Train whistle. The X line. All aboard the Big Hit Express. Woo-woo! 
Great start to this case. Daniel Murphy, 151 out of 199. That's for the Nationals. That also goes to the X line. Got to get used to the new parallels here. All right. Didn't Chris Davis get moved somewhere? I feel like he did. Or no, Chris Carter went to the A's, I think, to play with Chris Davis. 101 out of 299, Ryan Braun. I got to get keep track of all of the... That goes to the uh, Brewers. I got to keep track of all these moves. Joey Votto to 199, Reds. I think these are normal, okay. That's, I don't think we've seen this insert yet. There's Chris Bryant. Manuel Margot, Kirby Puckett, Tyler Glass now, Mitch Hanniger. Nice, that was box two. So this was a normal box, just a few parallels and a couple nice autos. Next box. All right, good luck everybody. Um, someone was asking earlier, Am I, yo, Ezekiel, yes, I am ripping Pantheon football tonight. So let's get that sold out. When I open the box, will I know if it's a hot box like 2014 select or no? How did it, how did that look in 2014 select? Oh, weren't there, wasn't there like a mini box that was a different color? I don't think so. I don't think there's any way to tell what the hot box is when you open it. I know, I kind of I kind of thought it was going to be an auto hotbox too, Paul T. Because of the early autos, but I got fooled as well. Um, allegedly, there is, can someone confirm this? Maybe on Cardboard Connection Doc, maybe some other website has it. Are there four hotboxes this year? Oh, yeah, so you're talking about the mini boxes, Sam. Yeah, no, I don't think there's any way to tell if this is going to be a hotbox when I open the uh, box. It's just got to rip everything open. And be surprised. Okay, so X line has confirmed it as well. Okay, so yeah, so the, it is four per case, two of each. A parallel hot box and an auto hot box. Awesome. And Craig confirming that as well. Nice. Last year was just two, right? Total, if I'm not mistaken. I know it's been a minute or two since we did a full case of last year's. All right, Frank Thomas leading us off. And we got 16 out of 99, Carson Kelly rated rookie autograph for the Cardinals. That goes to Jonathan Martin. So I think for these Diamond Kings cards, if the middle is a different color, That'll indicate the parallel. So that's a refractor and that's just normal. And as for the other cards, you can kind of tell by the sides. Like this one, Matt Kemp. Looks like gold. Yep, seven out of 10 Matt Kemp gold parallel for the Braves. That goes to Craig. And there's our next auto, Roman Quinn. Nice one for the fighting Phils. Phillies hit Thad with that one. I think the Phillies were kind of a late-ish pickup. So thank you, Thad. And that is out of 25, 11 out of 25. What, what is the name of that parallel out of 25? Slate? Gray? Oh, they just call it black. All right. Maybe this year I'll learn the proper names for all the parallels. <laughs> That'll be my goal this year. Ken Griffey Jr., this is just blue, right? 93 out of 149. 
Oh, come on. Do you guys really call it Carolina blue? They're going to call it Carolina blue? No, they just call it blue. I think for different sets, they call, they call them different colors. But anyway, blue, Ken Griffey Jr., 93 out of 149 for the Mariners. That'll go to Ed. Oh, yeah, that's numbered. That's what I thought. Carlos Correa, 9 out of 25 on that one. Astros. That will go to the X line. Mass and Bumgarner, the motorcycle rider. And that does it. Those are two autographs and a few parallels. Next box. Kish saying that, what, Quinn is super fast? He's a, he's a speedster. That's good. You know, the Phillies are kind of interesting, don't you think? The Phillies could have a scary good team with it within a few years because they've got a lot of young players coming up the ranks and young players that are getting um, that are getting playing time you know like regular playing time so they can start they can get used to major league pitching kind of work through all of that so it should be pretty interesting if you want to do another case of this ladies and gentlemen I'd be more than happy to jazbeeshobbyland.com another full case break a grown up break uh, a full course meal if you want to do that so you can get an appetizer on the 10 Buck Breaks channel, but if you're like, hmm, I can't fill up on bread, I can't fill up on mozzarella sticks, I need like a steak, jazbeeshobbyland.com for the full case breaks, folks. Jeff Dorlak asking, what basketball box or hot box where each card was a refractor? That sounds familiar. What, what was that? I, I feel like it was one of those sets where it was only like, like a couple boxes per case or something like that. And there'd be like a pack, an extra pack with all the refractor or something like that. Anyhow. Uh, next box, folks. Good luck. Javier Baez. Daniel Murphy. Dominator, Chris Davis. That's 72 out of 99. And rated rookie, Aaron Judge. Autograph on the board. And that would be Chris Danielson, who straight up popped in, said, Joe, what's up? Haven't seen you in a while. Just got the Yankees and a couple spots in Pantheon, rewarded with an Aaron Judge on-card autograph. No parallel, but still nice. Scared money don't make money, folks. Chris wasn't scared. He still, look at all these boxes you have left to go. You collect a few parallels together, <laughs> like you're gonna be more than taken care of on this break. Christian Yelich, Diamond Kings. 107 out of 299. Marlins. That'll go to Matt. Ziggy saying Optic's doing well with, with Judge. That's good news for Chris. Gregory Polanco. Pirates. 227 out of 299. That'll be for Sherry. Mass and Bumgarner. Looks like an orange background. 132 out of 199 for the Giants. A little opposite Joe Mojo. Uh, goes Thad. Aaron Judge rated rookie. Refractor. I mean, I wouldn't be surprised if that was like 20 bucks. And Optic Autographs, Jorge Lopez for the Brewers. Brew Crew. That goes to Ed. Actually, this goes right here. So there you go, Ed, autograph on the board. So 
So some nice hits out of this break already. Like I said, I'll be I'll be sleeving and top loading all of those parallels uh, once I'm done with this K. I just want to breeze through this break as quickly as possible, but I'll do it imme immediately after the break. All right, good luck, everybody. All right, maybe I'll just well, I'm gonna do a couple boxes at a time. Might also save a little time. Now, when this break is over, I don't think that uh, I don't think that we have anything else sold out. Let me let me just refresh the web page here. I don't think we have anything sold out, but we did get a couple team, couple more teams moving in uh, Donner's Optic Baseball. So maybe we can do another one of these breaks. Uh, Pantheon Football still stuck at twenty three. So head over to jazbeeshobbyland.com. Let's finish it off. Nick LaPlante, what's going on? Yes, the, we did pull an autograph of the boss man out of Allen and Ginter today. The odds on uh, the odds on us pulling one of those, like like extremely slim. Think about how many packs there are in in each box of Ginter. Third, third Think box. about how many. Third box. Uh, Think about how many packs there are in it, how many cards per pack there are, how many boxes there are per case. Um, man. Uh, Lee, what's going on? Uh, this is not random team number two. The main channel is, we're not doing random teams on the main channel. If you pay 10 bucks for a break, I think that you're talking about a uh, 10 buck break, which is on a different channel. There's a link right there, and Nick Jaspi's breaking that today, and he says that's already on YouTube. So this is pick your team number one. 12 box pick your team number one. Already pulled an Aaron Judge uh, autograph. Not a parallel, but a nice one nonetheless on card. And we've got, uh, we pulled a uh, out of five Alex Bregman autograph, which was great. Yeah, Kevin Crouch, yeah, we, the odds, so the, the, the odds of getting that boss man autograph, he only signed like 10 or 15 of them. There's a picture of it on the on the uh, uh, ten buck breaks Twitter at ten buck breaks. So there'll be a picture of him signing like months ago, and there'll be sign there'll be a picture of the one that we pulled today, <laughs> which is kind of crazy. Um, no, it'd be <laughs> it'd be impossible. Do you know you know how many cases they make of those? No, I don't. I don't think they would. They would. They would swing that favor. <laughs> it's just like because you, you they they manufacture the case. A lot of the cards are manufactured in um, in Texas. That's where most of the card manufacturing uh, happens. So it all happens in Texas. They're in big factories. They ship all that stuff, you know, to all the autographs to Texas. They, they throw them into the cases. There's hundreds of cases made, thousands and thousands of cards per case. You know, on all those are like literally randomly inserted to avoid anything like that, to avoid any impropriety, you know? And they, and from there, the, all those cases get shipped out to different, you know, to different distributors all around the country that then, that then get sold and distributed to, to card shops like us. All right, Matt Carpenter leading us off. Yeah, it's it's. <laughs> you should hear Nick on the video. He was freaking out. Like it, it, that's how surprised we were too. Double O two out of one forty nine. Another Alex Bregman for Josh X line. The X line with the Astros. That's a nice Bregman PC you can have going there. Another Aaron Judge. We'll set that aside. That'll probably be, go for like ten bucks. <laughs> that non refractor base card. Rated rookie Jacoby Jones, 30 out of 35. Wasn't he a receiver, Jacoby Jones? Uh, that goes to the Tigers. That goes to Paul Harris. Out of 35, Jacoby Jones. Actually, let's leave this up right now. Set that right there. There he is again.
trout. Bregman Refractor. And Manuel Margot. Nice. Manny Margot autograph for the Padres. Not numbered. Base auto, but Padres are on the board. Sherry. With the former Red Sox prospect. Playing pretty... Had some injuries, but playing pretty decently this season. Um, the other Red Sox prospect that got traded a while back... Yoan Mankata made his debut today. Dansby Swanson out of 99. We got Andrew Benintendi. 202 out of 299 for the Red Sox. That one goes to Jonathan Martin. Dansby Swanson again. 204 out of 299 for the Braves. Another one for Craig. And another box right here. We have not seen, this might be an autograph hot box. Tyler Glasnow autograph for the Pirates. That goes to Sherry and the Buckos. Did Jones take a ball to the face? Jacoby Jones? Tyler Glasnow. Andrew McCutcheon, another one for the Pirates. One out of ten on that one. And Gavin Ciccini. Autograph. Rated rookie auto for the Yankees. That goes to Chris Danielson. Wait, Gavin Cheney's a Met, right? Sorry. Yeah, Gavin, sorry. Gavin Cheney's a Met. I need to write that down before that gets confusing. When the sorters are zipping through that process. Yeah, I caught it. I was just like, wait a second. I just saw pinstripes in New York. Uh, now 021, Mark, with that one. Mets. Daniel Murphy, gold. 10 out of 10. The Daniel Murphy Nationals, the X line with that one. That's nice. Uh, Vladimir Guerrero Jr., nice. 54 out of 149. The prospects insert for the Blue Jays. That will go to Matt D. Tyler Glass now Refractor. David Dahl, rated rookie refractor. Chris Bryant, Aqua. 69 out of 299 for the Cubbies. I believe Mary Lou has the Cubs. She does. I thought this was going to be an autograph hot. I got fooled again, Paul T. Look at this. I thought this was going to be an autograph hot box. We haven't seen one yet. All right. So we got the Chichini. We got the Glasnow. We got the Margot and the Jacoby Jones and a bunch of parallels that I'll sleeve. Uh, later on. Let's do another two boxes. They don't hide anything under these, right? I always get paranoid that they'll like, one year they'll do like, they'll do something where they're, they'll be like, oh yeah, we're going to hide something underneath there. Throw away like an Aaron Judge box topper <laughs> or a box bottomer. I guess it wouldn't be a topper. Box floor, floor. Right. All right, next two boxes, folks. We're making good time on this. I think, I don't know when I started actually. Am I making good time on this? I saw a couple teams being picked up already in the next full case pick your team break of this one. Um, I would like to try some uh, Pantheon football today too, just to get a look at that. And Grand Reserve Basketball, we've got a half case break that's only twenty nine ninety nine a spot in a half case basketball break. So basketball fans, hoops fans, if you want to step up, 
do it. Make it happen. Would love to try that new release out today too. JaspiesHobbyland.com on all that. We also have an upper deck release. Marvel Premiere. There's only five cards per pack on that one. That's on JaspiesHobbyland.com. And you're going to look at the price point and you're going to be like, holy crap. Like, is it really 60 bucks a card? Yeah, it's a random card, but there are two sketch cards per box. And the other cards are like low numbers and short prints and whatnot. And generally, and it includes the entire Marvel Universe. So it's not just Spider-Man and it's not just Guardians of the Galaxy. It'll include the entire uh, breadths of the Marvel Universe. So go ahead and check that out on jazbeeshobbyland.com and give that a shot. I know we have some, uh, some Marvel fans out there. Dano, what's going on? I, hey, <laughs> Michael House is kind of laughing and saying, hey, talk about Lonzo Ball and the break will sell out. I'm telling you, whether you like him or not, Lonzo Ball moves the needle. I'll tell you what. Um, I just heard a stat earlier today. On the NBA, I believe, Instagram on the NBA Instagram page. The video that the official NBA Instagram took of Lonzo Ball being introduced just in a summer league game, a freaking summer league game, was the sixth most watched video in NBA Instagram history. Think about it. <laughs> it's something like that. And so are you telling me that Lonzo Ball doesn't move the needle? Like, we've jokingly talked about Lonzo Ball to pretend to move breaks, and it's actually worked a couple times. <laughs> That's the crazy part. <laughs> like him or not, that guy gets people fired up. Either people overhype him, <laughs> you know, in, all, in almost like a Tebow-ish kind of way. Like, they think he's going to be like some sort of savior of the Lakers. Or people just hate him. People think he's arrogant, whatever the case may be. But they probably hate his dad more than they actually hate him. But it's kind of it's kind of crazy. Like him or not, he moves the needle. Okay. Next two boxes. We've got a re what's a what's the, what are the redemptions here? Do you guys know what the redemptions are? There's Anthony Rizzo orange out of 199. Any guesses on that redemption? Jackie Bradley Jr. Rio Ruiz, rated rookie autograph for the Braves. That will go to Craig. Trevor May, is this our autograph hot box? It might be. Trevor May for the Twins. Nice refractor auto. It's part of that studio set. Twins, that'll go to Chris Danielson. What's up, Casey? The X line saying Josh Jackson, Lonzo finish, one and two in rookie of the year. Both will be stars in the NBA, but still not a fan of Lonzo. More precisely, yep, it's his dad. That, that'll do it. Chris Sale, 26 out of 299. Uh, that goes to the Red Sox. That'll go to Jonathan Martin. Michael Reed. Yep, this is an autograph hot box. Michael Reed autograph for the Brew Crew. That's another one for, it's another Milwaukee Brewer for Ed. Ed Aarons with that one. Frank Thomas Aqua. 72 out of 299 for the White Sox. Adam Wilson. And Herman Marquez, the young pitcher for the Rockies. Out of 11 out of 150 for Colorado. That goes to the X line. There you go. Josh with that one. Brian Dozier, Dominator, blue, 106 out of 149. And these inserts here at the end. Vet base doesn't ship in this, but all those fun inserts will ship. All right, let's see what this, so we got the, got these guys here. Let's see what this redemption's gonna be. Bam, Orlando Arcia, rated rookie signatures for the Brewers. Nice one for Ed Ahrens and the Brew Crew.
Frank, what's going on? Yeah. Well, we always pull big hits. Pulled a, uh, the biggest hit today is probably uh, Mike Jaspi autograph. Mike Jasperson, boss man autograph from Alan and Ginter. Nick pulled that one. Pulled an out of five Alex Bregman from this case and an Aaron Judge base auto out of this case too. 84 out of 299, Nick Markakis for the Braves and Craig. We've got Alex Reyes, rated rookie autograph. That'll go to the Cardinals. That'll be for Jonathan Martin. Tyler Naquin, 50 out of 50. Studio autograph. That'll go to the tribe, Sherry. <laughs> there is. I'm not even joking. Look at our uh, 10 Buck Breaks channel, brought to you by Jaspies. Uh, check that out, at 10 Buck Breaks on, our, on Twitter, and you'll see a picture of him signing a little while back, and you'll see a picture of the autograph that Nick Jaspi literally pulled like an hour ago. <laughs> Tulo, out of 199 for Toronto. Madison Bumgarner Elite Series, out of 149 for the Giants. That'll go to Thad. Opposite Joe Mojo there. Carlos Correa for the X line, 263 out of 299. Will Myers in the back. Should I be pulling these Bellinger rated rookies? I'm sure, right, Dodgers? Neil Mordowitz with the Dodgers. I'm sure they have some sort of value, some judge like value on a secondary market. Judges, or Bellinger's better looking. Whoa! I think, right? of, course, of course he is. Yeah, he has a cycle. Yeah, Aaron Judge doesn't have a cycle. <laughs> Cody Bellinger has hit for the cycle already. Pfft. Aaron Judge, what can he do? Hit home runs? Yeah. A lot of people can He's hit like home six, runs. Seven, like you know? Yeah. Like yeah, anyone can hit home runs. Can you hit for the cycle, though? Wait, what happened, Dano? You're a victim of identity theft. Someone tried to make a purchase at an upholstery store. Jeez. Was it bad upholstery? It'd be even worse if you found out it was just bad upholstery as well. Not only, they're already, it's already bad enough that they're thieves, but thieves without good taste, that's even worse. <laughs> yeah, Rory, it's been looking pretty good. And even Mark saying, hey, I'm not, generally not a fan of this non-licensed baseball stuff, but even he has to admit this stuff looks all right. But yeah, identity theft is pretty terrible. Um, I'm, sure, I'm sure the banks, credit card companies are usually pretty, pretty good about getting funds right back to you, I think. I think they they do the they do the heavy lifting for that, but I'm pretty sure. Um, I think the only the hassle really is just waiting for the uh, <laughs> waiting for the card to get back in the mail. Um, yeah, but we hit some nice stuff. We had a we have an out of five uh, out of five Alex Bregman autograph that we pulled for the X line. We pulled an Aaron Judge autograph. A uh, base autograph, which is pretty nice. Ziggy's saying that it seems like it's one judge per case. Interesting. And all all have been base judge autos. Oh, good. Your bank was good about it. Awesome, Dano. Well, I'm glad it wasn't anything worse. Uh, John Oakley is saying a lot of redemptions in Ginter this year. You know who's not a redemption in Allen and Ginter? The boss man, Mike Jasperson, is an autograph, is a mini auto. There's one less in the world because we already pulled one. But he is not a redemption. No way. I'd say he's a top player. 
Mr. Okre. Sorry about that. Uh, Sam, they're just not licensed to use the team names, but they have the Players Association license, which allows them to use the uh, to use the t the players' names. Just can't use the baseball logos. So you'll see that on the helmets and stuff like that, they'll they'll Photoshop out the logos. Oh, a Floyd Mayweather auto would be pretty cool, and then you pair it with a Conor McGregor autograph, and you frame that up. That'd be pretty cool. Carter, will there be any, be any Bowman's Best anytime soon? Probably not. That stuff has been pretty hard to find. Bowman's Best, Finest, Tier 1. They didn't print a lot of those. So they went fast. They sold fast. They sold well. Now it's hard to get. Um, I don't think there are very many Boss Man autos out there. All right, Brad Miller, and what's this? Back to the Future, Josh Reddick, 20 out of 50, Whoa. autograph. That's pretty cool. Josh Reddick auto for Jay Kreider and the A's. Yeah, I think 10 or 15, Josh. I, I, forget, I forget how many he signed when the Topps rep was here. <laughs> I honestly forget, but it wasn't very many. Jose Altuve, Aqua for the X-Line, 110 out of 299. It would be a pull, cool pull. Uh, Dano, there's Jorge Alfaro, rated rookie autograph. Uh, it would be a cool pull because if you pull from us, Dano, you win $1,000 of break credit. We already gave, we already gave away 1000 bucks today. That's for the Phillies. That goes to Thad. There's Ryan Healy. They should have made sure you guys got them. We've gotten 100, given 100 away each hit. Why would they do that? I don't know if Sam really gets how this is supposed to work. Jake Thompson, on-card autograph, another Philly for Thad. Um, I forget who got the bounty, but it was a name I've seen before. Not a not a not a super regular, but someone whose name I have seen before. Yadier Molina, seventeen out of two ninety-nine, Cardinals. Gregory Polanco, those are not numbered. Braden Shipley, uh, four out of 50 for the D-backs. That goes to Matt D with the Diamondbacks. Uh, it's on Twitter. It's on our new channel's Twitter, at 10 Buck Breaks. This looks like a autograph hot box. I think I retweeted on our main Twitter as well, at Jaspi's Hobby. And Cody Ballinger, nice. 27 out of 99. That goes to the Dodgers. Neil Mordowitz with that one. Uh, Jeff Hoffman, 70 out of 75. Formerly a uh, Blue Jays prospect, but made his way to the Rockies and is pitching pretty decently. The X-Line with that one. More Braden Shipley for the Diamondbacks at a 299. Another Aaron Judge, Christian Royo, and Chris Sale in the back right there. All right, next box. It, what, are, what are you talking about? It means nothing to people who don't watch us. Do you know how many people watch us, Sam? 13 out of 299, Jose Altuve for the Astros.
That goes to the X line, of course. He's been doing pretty well. You're racking up autographs and parallels out of here, X line. It's nice. There's Yasmai Tomas, 234 out of 299 for the Diamondbacks. Cody Bellinger, rated rookie again. There's Orlando Arcia for the Brewers, 26 out of 99. Brew Crew, that goes to Ed. Jose De Leon. Autograph, that goes to the Rays. That's Rays' version of Jose De Leon, former Dodger prospect. Brian Dozier for the Twins, 46 out of 299. And Alberto Mejia. Adalberto Mejia. That goes to the Twins. And that's one for Chris Danielson. Yeah, the other thing, I think people don't realize how long the boss man has been involved in the hobby. Yeah, he worked for over over 10 years at Beckett. He was the price guide editor for Beckett from the 70s through the 80s. He worked for Tops for like 10 plus years, um, launching, like pretty much starting their, um, pretty much starting their, uh, their Tops Vault program from scratch. And building it up into like a multi multi million dollar sales avenue for for the tops company. He's owned a number of hobby shops in the past. He's pretty much been to every national except for a few since the beginning. So he's been involved from the get go. The boss man's dad, Nick's grandfather, was one of the first um, the first guys in the hobby back in the day to start a hobby related magazine. So boss man's got some journalism in his family. So that was pretty much the the grandfather of Beckett magazine, essentially. So for a lot of the people in the hobby, you go through like when, when we go to the national and, you know, when we try to take a, a walk with the boss man through the national, like everyone's stopping him. You know what I mean? We, like we can't go five, ten minutes without someone stopping him wanting like five minutes of his time just to say hi, just say what's up. So he's been around the circuit. It's kind of a big deal. Yeah, someone held Jason Jaspi out in the hockey channel. All right, folks. Brandon Richards about to win some money tomorrow on, on Fantasy Golf. Are you doing DraftKings Golf? Here's our last two boxes, folks. We made it. I don't know how long this took me, but pretty solid right here. There you go. John Ogre says, My friend's grandfather started the first ever catalog to order cards way back in the day. Larry Fritch Cards in Stevens Points, Wisconsin. That's cool. I want I mean I wouldn't be surprised if if they've crossed if Bossman cross paths with that person as well. Nice, Brandon. Well good luck. I want you to make a little extra hobby money to spend with Jaspies. Yeah, that is awesome though. I agree. Michael House. Looks like uh Sammy at 135 wants to uh, wants to have a little friendly wager with you. Yeah, well, now that you said that publicly, we definitely cannot hire you as cheap child labor and pay you in break credit. Man, don't really know how that works, huh? All right, 
Subtlety, Sam. Got to learn that. It's important in life. Okay, two boxes to go, boys and girls. Good luck. There's Will Myers, 53 out of 149. That goes to the the Myers to the Friars. Jackie Bradley Jr., Red Sox, 299. This might be our other... Uh, yeah, this looks like our J. Bruce for the Mets out of 149. Our other uh, parallel hot box. Corey Kluber, 41 out of 149. That'll go to the Tribe. Kyle Hendricks for the Cubs, 29 out of 149 from Mary Lou and the Cubbies. Marcus Simeon out of 199, 197 out of 199 for the A's. Brandon Belt, orange, out of 199 for the Giants. Luke Weaver, red, for the Cardinals. That's out of 50. Let's leave that up for Jonathan Martin. Nice, another autograph for you. Jordan Montgomery, Yankees, 40 out of 99. Carlos Correa, another one for the X-Line. 47 out of 99. Duke Snyder for the Dodgers. Nice. Out of 199 for Neil Mordowitz and my Dodgers. Chris Davis, red. 90 out of 99 for the A's. For Jay Kreider. Dustin Pedroia, Red Sox. Jonathan Martin, out of 299. Are these numbered? Yeah, that one's numbered. It's kind of like a, the aquish color threw me off. Uh, 48 out of 50, Luke Weaver, rated rookie, parallel. Christian Yelich, orange, Marlins, out of 199. Matt D with the Marlins. Dominator, Kyle Hendricks, Mary Lou, out of 149. Michael Fulmer, aqua, out of 299. Tigers. Uh, Mookie Betts, Red Sox. So many of you. Mookie Betts, Red Sox, 4 out of 99. Freddie Freeman, he's back in action. Four out of 99 for the Braves. Rick Porcello, Red Sox. That'll be out of 149. Adrian Beltre, 53 out of 99 for the, almost said Texans, for the Rangers. And Eric Gonzalez is your other rated rookie autograph. That is for the Tribe. That will go to Sherry. Nice. And the last bit right here, we got Steven Piscotti for the Cardinals at a 149. And there's Jose De Leon. Nice. All right. I'll sleeve all of these up. And the final box on this side right here. Good luck, everybody. We've got another full case break available on jazpiecehobbyland.com right now. Check it out. 271 out of 299. Marlins. That goes to Matt D. Dansby Swanson autograph. Nice on-card auto. Dansby Swanson Braves Craig. Nice one, Craig. Nice. And you got an Aaron Judge right here. Lee, are you looking at the... Oh, are you looking at 10 Buck Breaks? The YouTube or YouTube channel? If, or ask Nick on the 10 Buck Breaks channel. He's on there right now. You can yell at him. <laughs> and Jarrell Cotton, former Dodgers prospect, now an Oakland Athletic, is your final autograph here. That goes to Jay Kreider and the A's. Bregman Refractor, Corey Kluber, Orange, 55 out of 199. No, it's a completely separate thing, Lee. Completely separate channel, completely separate videos. There will be a, Eventually, there will be a completely separate website. There's Clint Frazier out of 149 for the Yankees. I don't know why the first one would be there, though. That must, that must be a mistake. And the last bit here, maybe another parallel. Yep, Salvador Perez, Royals, 115 out of 299. That'll go to Matt 
And the last bit, Cespedes Refractor. And we close out with David Dahl, Rated Rookie. No randomizers, nothing else to do. Thank you very much, ladies and gentlemen. That was a pretty great break. We've got some Rated Rookie, Cody Bellinger. And out of five, Train Whistle, Alex Bregman. Aaron Judge autograph and a, and a stack of other great autographs, too. What a great break. we got another case available at jazbeeshobbyland.com. This is Joe, and we'll baseball with you next time. Bye-bye.